Monday morning, 644. Glad you're with us here on GMSA. Over 20 years of training some of the world's most extraordinary animals. That's the job of SeaWorld Ambassador Catherine Brown. She is not only inspiring those around her, but also young women everywhere. Eric Hernandez spent time with Catherine in this week's Year of the Woman story. Look at you. SeaWorld San Antonio is home to a large array of animals from all over the world. One woman is leading the pack in training these animals. Her name is Catherine Brown. Every day is different. Working with animals is kind of like working with kids. Sometimes you have really amazing fun days and other days it's a little bit more about learning and things like that. Look at all this fun stuff. It wasn't until a college SeaWorld trip that made Catherine realize her calling was working with animals. And after 20 years of work at SeaWorld San Antonio, she is now responsible for the well-being of over 400 animals with only a staff of 20. We have to do a lot of things to take care of the animals every day, to take care of, make sure their food is good, to make sure their habitats are clean, take them out and introduce them to our guests and to students around San Antonio. I'll ask Bataka to get on the box there. Even though it's hard work, Catherine gets a lot of joy out of doing presentations for kids. When you see a five-year-old's face light up, when they see an owl for the first time or a lemur for the first time, or they get to touch a snake, it's amazing. And she's not only making an impact for the animals she's helping every day, but she's also hoping to inspire more women to follow in her footsteps. If you work hard and you put your heart into it and you are adventurous, that really opens up a lot of doors. Now, besides taking care of all those animals, Catherine is also a single mother of two. She is definitely blazing a trail for women who want to be animal trainers. Now, for more on Catherine Brown and our past year of the woman's stories, just head to ksat.com. Mark and Leslie.